welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. My name is Vicky and this is Oscar. Hello. <laughs> I'm going to say Happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. So today um, we're doing a little Mother's Day vlog. We're going to film what we're going to get up to today. Yeah. And also this is my 18 week pregnancy update. From now on I'll be doing weekly pregnancy updates. Um, but first, should we talk about Mother's Day? What do you think Mother's Day is all about? I don't know. What do you think it's all about? What I did don't you know. What did you do for Mummy this morning? Give me a card. You gave me a card and tell everyone what the card said inside. He said I love you more than Daddy. <laughs> so Oscar says this. He doesn't actually mean it. He's just being funny, aren't you? <laughs> no. You are being funny. Um, I'm not. But you have said this, and look at my beautiful necklace that Oscar got me. So this is a Mercy Mama necklace. So I first saw this on my beautiful friend Lucy Jessica Carter. I'm sure you all follow her, but if you don't, I will link her YouTube channel in the box below. Um, but yeah, she, she um, first had one of these on, not this exact one I don't think but just lovely company so it's engraved on one side it says the Norris family and on the other side it says from Oscar Isla and baby can you tell everyone two things you love about mommy no, you can't think of any. Shall, shall I go first okay so two things I love about you I love how you always put everyone first so you always think of other people before yourself don't you? And I love how loving you are and how many times you give mummy kisses and cuddles in a day. Can you say two things you love about mummy? Are <laughs> you shy? There's no one there, it's just a camera. Don't worry. I love you because you gave me loads of kisses in every day. Aww, do you like your kisses? Do you love mummy? I love you. Give me a kiss. Mwah. Right, anything Oscar's bored now, so why don't you say bye to the camera? Say bye everyone. Bye bye everyone. And you will see Oscar later on in this video having fun at a party because we've got your friend's party later. And then we're going to go and see your nana. So that was my lovely little boy, Oscar. Um, so I am 18 weeks pregnant with my second little boy and um, we found out with a little boy at 16 weeks We had an early scan. Um, please go and look at the video. It is my favorite video ever. It's a real tearjerker Update how am I feeling so I'm one of those really annoying people I feel absolutely fine feel totally totally fine early on in pregnancy I had a little bit of nausea, but nothing nothing major. I feel fine I am a little bit more tired than normal, but then I'm really busy with work. So if you don't know what I do, um, I fit hair extensions. We're in my salon room now, actually, because there's gas works outside and it's really noisy in every other room. Anyway, I've been really busy with work, so I'm not sure if I'm tired because of pregnancy or if it's because I am just really busy. So at 18 weeks pregnant, the baby should be 14.2 centimetres from head to bottom. So, I mean, if you add the legs, I suppose a small rule is 15 centimetres, isn't it? So, baby should be sort of about this size. So, it says on my pregnancy app, so I use the Baby Centre app, that the baby should be as big as a bell pepper. However, I do think this baby is bigger than what the apps say, purely because when we went for our 16-week scan, it was, it was measuring two centimetres bigger than it should have been at that stage anyway. Um, I do produce children with very long legs because I'm five foot nine myself. And also, I have been feeling the baby kick, which is really lovely. Not every single day. Of an evening, usually, if I'm sort of laying down on the sofa, um, Simon's actually felt him kick. So he must have really long, strong legs because when he's obviously facing the right way and he kicks upward, um, Simon has felt him kick and it's so nice so in the middle of the night if I wake up at two or three in the morning to go to the toilet as I usually do I feel him kick and it's really nice um, not so good that I feel him kick at night or when I'm asleep but maybe it's just because I'm not moving around I, I feel it more 
So yeah, feeling lots of movements. Um, when I don't feel him kick, I do feel sort of little flutters. So it feels like, it feels a little, <laughs> It feels a little bit like wind. Any other symptoms? So I am a little bit more uncomfortable when I eat. I'm not sure why, but after I eat, I sort of, I'm not sure if it's indigestion or I'm not sure really. I kind of just get like a sore bit at the top of my tummy. Uh, so it could be indigestion. Um, so I've read what things I can do. It says eat smaller portions, which is impossible because in the last three weeks, I would say, I cannot stop eating carbs. That's all I want. I'm trying to be as healthy as possible. So that's quite annoying, but baby obviously needs it. Uh, so I'm just gonna embrace it, it's fine. So I'm gonna do a little bump update now. So this is my bump. You see it here? Can't really see that, can you? I didn't really think about this outfit choice. I'm wearing a jumpsuit. Hang on a minute. I will take the jumpsuit down and show you my bump. My lovely little bump. Uh, so definitely bigger this time. Um, I have had to take out my belly bar. Look out my, my massive belly button. I've had to take out my belly bar because it was getting really sore. I didn't want to take it out, but that was that. And there's it from the other side. So that was my bump update. A lot bigger than it was before, uh, but growing really nicely. So I love having a bump because it makes you actually look and feel more pregnant. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited to see it grow even more, weirdly, but yeah, I'm really excited. So Oscar's got a cheese sandwich, haven't you Oscar? Yeah. And you're just doing your beads, so PJ mask beads, which you love, don't I you? I love what, how much I've done. So where are we going after you finish your sandwich? Theo's party. Yeah. party Oscar is absolutely exhausted he loved it loads um, I'm on my way to see my mum because I haven't seen her today yet so we're just going around for a cup of tea and a piece of cake uh, Oscar's decided he doesn't want to come because he's super tired uh, so my mum will be a little bit sad but um, he's really tired he just wants to chill out and I think Oscar uh, I think Simon's gonna run him a bath early and get him to bed and then when I get back later me and Simon are gonna have a takeaway
you enjoy your book, Matilda? Did you like Theo's party? Yes. And you're tired, aren't you? No. From all the running around? No, I'm not. Do you think Mummy's had a nice Mother's Day? Um. yes. Are you going to give Mummy a kiss? Yeah. Love you, love you, love you, love you, oh. It's bedtime now, isn't it? Yes, it is. Just read your favourite book, haven't we? Should we show them? It is called The Matilda Wellington. It's called Matilda. And what's just happened in your book? What just happened with the parrot? They thought that so that there was a ghost, but it's just a parrot. Yeah. <laughs> that was funny, wasn't it? Okay. Say bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. Say happy Mother's Day, everyone. Happy Mother's Day, everyone. Bye. I'm finishing off Mother's Day with a takeaway. I've made a healthy-ish choice with a chicken kebab. Um, as we've got holiday on Tuesday. I've had a lovely, lovely day. I'm really tired. A party was amazing. And I've been thoroughly spoiled and looked after by my husband. I uh, hope you all enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and give me a big thumbs up if you like this video.